Hello viewers, welcome back to our channel. In this video, we are going to learn how to multiply numbers using Abacus. I'll teach you two digit into one digit multiplication in this video. Let us go ahead. Take this problem 24 multiplied with 7. Multiplication using Abacus is very easy. Two rules have to be followed while multiplying. When a two digit number is multiplied with a single digit number, we get a we get a three digit answer. For example, if we multiply 25 with 4, we get an answer as 100, where 25 is a two digit number and 4 is a single digit number and the answer 100 is a three digit number. Let us go ahead by multiplying 24 with 7. First step is multiply 2 and 7. 2 and 7 gives 14 as usual. Now we have to place 14 from the hundreds rod. That is, this is units rod, this is tens rod, this is hundreds rod. Now 14 is 1 and 4. This is 14 from hundreds rod. Let us multiply the other digits 4 and 7. Now 4 and 7 is 28 as you all know. Now 28 should be added from the tenths rod. This is ones rod and this is tenths rod. So let us add 28. 20 and 8. We got the answer as 168. This is our final answer. Let us take another example which is a different concept. I will explain you the concept over here. Let us try to multiply 38 with 2. 38 with 2. The first step as usual is 3 into 2. 3 into 2 gives us 6. Now 6 is a single digit number. Now remember when you get a single digit number in the first stage we have to apply the zero rule. Zero rule is very simple. Zero rule states that whenever you get a single digit number in the beginning append a zero in the beginning. Now six is read as zero six. We all know that we have to place zero six from the hundreds rod. Zero on the hundreds rod. You need tens hundreds. Zero means we have to place nothing over here and six is this. So we got 60. Second step is multiplying 8 with 2. We get 16. We have to add 16 from the tens rod. This is 1 and this is 6. We got the answer as 76. Thank you for watching. If you have liked the video and want to learn more about Abacus concepts, subscribe to our channel. I'll post more videos and Abacus lessons. If you have any doubts or feedback, kindly comment below. Thank you.